They're pretty good, aren't they? You can blame their number of bases or the other factors, Father. But the truth is, they simply outlasted you. Sonia? Though not so much outlasted, I just more outmaneuvered him because Kambe was too focused on the bridge, but okay. But Sonia! Father, please, stop that whining. Get a go, Kame Commander, for goodness sake. <sighs> yes, of course, you're right. I am. So what should we, I do now? Well, first of all, we obviously need to match or exceed their number of bases. Uh. Of course, Kambe must have many bases, too. Yes, but also keep in mind... <laughs> so it is decided. Kambe shall secure as many bases near the enemy, and with them, our victory is assured. Uh. Father, wait no Oh, gone again. Doesn't he realize that the proper location of bases is just as important as their numbers? <sighs> Take the disguises and capture cities before Kambe's ground, uh, ground your troops. Oh boy, I think it's time. The most iconic line, and of course we gotta go with our boy. I've got this. That combat guy has got us surrounded. <laughs> On top of that, we need to secure properties to win. This is gonna be a rough one for sure. Stay positive, boys. At least we have an airport this time. Awesome! What's an airport again? Uh, Andy, you're an absolute idiot, but hey, that's like one of the most iconic lines in the entire series. You're kidding, right? Max is every single Advance Wars player after they hear that line. Airports let us deploy air units, plus damaged planes and copters can recover HP. <laughs> oh, right, obviously, I get it now, but isn't that Kambe's base right there? Mm -hmm. Don't worry about the base. Take a closer look at where it's located. The base deploys ground units, right? Well, it's out in the middle of nowhere, so it's pretty useless there, wouldn't you say? Let's ignore that base and capture other bases in cities with better positions. We need to cap capture 15 properties to win. All right, so we got a small number of troops right now. We only got a handful of infantry. We got a transport copter. We got battle copters. We do got a couple of anti-air units that we can use to deal with the battle copters as well as the uh, fighters out here. Oh, actually, they they are using the the dual strike design for their transport. That's actually nice because in the original it was just basically a recolor of the orange star air transport. Oh, they got a bomber up there, so let's go take care of that first and foremost. Uh, let's get ourselves infantry. I guess we can send our battle copter out to engage their helicopter. We'll put you right here. Hopefully, I can draw him into the missile range. Ah! Oh, no. I got scared. I accidentally ended my turn. Look what Kambe has discovered, a base for many of our troops, for our many troops. With this base, I should deploy a mountain of troops. Our forces will overwhelm our adversaries. shoot you down, no problem. Alright, 
right, that takes care of that. Let's hit this fighter now. I feel like those propellers should not be spinning fast enough to keep that thing flying. He's always going to have that early lead. I don't know why you decided to go behind him, because now you're just within range of my missiles. build an APC there. You figured that he would wait to build a missile truck or something. As much as I want to go harass his troops to keep him from taking too many properties, I'd rather just get another transport build and get the troops sent out. Does he have any airports? No, he doesn't. So we have the only airports here, so technically if we take out his transport copters, he is basically trapped on that island. Mm. Now nah, hold off on it. Oh, please waste it. Please waste it. He's not going to. You know what? I'll just use a hyper repair and get the scene fixed. I need 9,000 to get another battle copter built. And all my transports already in use, so for now, we'll just wait for next turn, get a hyper repair, then we'll go harass that infantry to keep him from building any more things down there. Combi's units are like gotta be the most varied out of all of them because it's just like, or I should just say gold common in, in general. Because like some carry backpacks, there's like three different infantry styles. What are you even doing on that island, dude? 
it's just like it's kind of insane of it like how much variety gold comet has in this game and then infantry. And I probably should also get mechs built next time as well. I should have guessed that's not going to do much because that's just get instantly going to get fully healed. I've made a grave error. Nothing can stop me. No, I'm not gonna use it to attack. I guess you're gonna attack with the tanks. Do we have to capture? Is it 15? Mm -hmm. I already captured. Okay, it is 15 properties. Okay. 14. So I gotta stop him from capturing the property up there. I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to stop Kanbei from taking that. Uh, uh, I'm kind of worried. I think I should have gone through the center island first to capture the airport.
Uh, damn. Now we have to hope for the best and get really lucky here. I got like one extra turn to do this. Good luck. <sighs> I do not remember Gold Comet being this difficult to fight. Okay, yeah, because he's too focused on doing that, he can't send those anti-air units to take out my copter. Speaking of copter, you get out of here. Man, had I remembered this was such an infantry focus level, I definitely would have picked Sammy over Andy. there. Oh, please tell me that you're in range of those missiles. Please tell me you're in range of the missiles. I so would love it if you were. You are not. All right, fine. Well, guess what? You you might be out of range of the missiles, but you're not out of range of my fighter. All right. Uh, let's see. Okay, we got a little bit more time. I don't want to risk losing my helicopters just yet, so I think I'll wait one more turn before we launch the attack on him. Fuel's getting a little low, but nothing to really worry about yet. I doubt this is going to do anything, Conde, but you do you, I guess.
Alright, with that, Kambe is now trapped on this island. I just need to take out any of his infantry and keep him from capturing that city. I still got one more day to do so, so a little bit of breathing room. Hopefully we can just absolutely swarm his anti-air units and cut them off. That's everything. I'm just doing a quick double check just to make sure it's just like, do I have everybody in position to do their job? Yeah. What do you think has been going through this infantry guy's mind? He just sees that swarm of helicopters sitting right outside the city while he alone has been trying to capture it for the past like three days. fact, he doesn't even have any infantry to capture the cities left. They're all trapped on that one small island down there, and I'm gonna lose all my battlecopters here, unfortunately. But hey, the sacrifice was worth it to save us from failing this mission. But also, he overplayed his hand. He lost all of them in the transports that he shot down. And now the only infantry are trapped on that island with no way to get out. And with that, victory goes to Andy. useless base that was and my assured victory vanished so quickly could it be that the base was in poor a poor location that was fun let's keep battling ah uh, Kambe, only person who could lose an air battle to somebody who doesn't even know what an airport is